Yo. Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy, Little Man J, coming to you with another video. And today, on this episode of Cartilation Videos, we're going to be unboxing the brand new iPhone 13 Pro Max. <laughs> got some real excitement over there. You see it. Here it is. I got the brand new iPhone 13 Pro Max to review for you guys. Now, for further ado, let's go check it out. Okay, before I open this quick disclaimer, this phone has already been opened and set up at the iPhone store. But for the sake of this video, I'm gonna do it again. So let's go. As you know, the originally it has these strips on the box that you just tear off. Those have already been turned off since I told you that it has been opened before. But let's just do this. Voila, the iPhone 13 Pro Max. Check it out, guys. The moment of truth. You ready? Oh, oh, that's satisfying. Oh my god, there the phone is truly beautiful. That's the back. You got the three cameras to prove that we don't play. We don't get no minis here. This is the Pro Max. It's go big or go home, baby. Now let's check out what's different about it from the 12. On this phone, if you're a previous iOS user or you just know your iPhones, you can see that this iPhone 13 Pro Max is not so different from the iPhone 12 Pro Max. Well, the only notable, the only noticeable. The only noticeable difference here is the notch. That that's the only biggest difference. The notch is this little thing here on the iPhone the 12 Pro Max. It is bigger, and uh, it, this one is just smaller. That's the only noticeable difference. And that's basically what I can say. But as soon as you pick the phone up, you can see that our other difference is that compared to the iPhone 12 Pro Max, this baby is heavier. And that is because of the battery. Because this one is using a stronger, bigger battery meaning it lasts longer than the iphone 12 pro max just think it lasts you about a day and it charges really quickly as well we got the cameras here now, although the cameras may be the same these ones are smarter than the cameras of an iphone 12 pro max they are designed to do things that the iphone 12 pro max can't and one of my favorite things because i'm an aesthetic i'm an aesthetic person i like to take pictures of glass and you know those detailed pictures those really nice pictures one of my favorite things is that on this version they've added the macro lens and in older versions of iphone like the iphone 12 for some reason iphone just refused to put that but they thought that they needed to do that on this one so they've added the macro lens which i say is really cool now let's turn it on and check it out Next, let me get some hard drive. Some good water. That is some good water. Okay. Now, moment of truth. Let's open the phone. I mean, let's turn on the phone. And this is anticlimactic voila the iphone logo meaning that the phone is on just gotta give it a few seconds and it should be on okay the phone has turned on now before i open this one i just want to show you guys you see this is the notch i was talking about if it wasn't that visible earlier on the iphone 12 pro max this notch is bigger it basically takes off like half of the screen but in this one it's smaller that's the notable difference except for the like weight you can see that's the home screen just quickly unlock it and exit that and there it is it's basically similar to the iphone 12 in terms of the app and how the apps are put you can see that's how it is and it's basically cool but one thing i want to mention that just makes this phone just worth buying is the promotion not promotion like getting a uh, pro promoted from a job like promotion this is pro motion see this is per pro motion see you get it? the pro motion is basically the, the phone just basically moves with you it's made of this high sense feel where it does exactly what you want when you wanted to do it and you can see how nice the typing or using this phone basically is like you know how you're scrolling through a website and this is where promotion comes in for example you're scrolling through a website 
stuff like that and then you just go do this then the website goes really fast or it just goes really slow or sometimes it goes really fast and it just stops out of nowhere while in this one let me just enter safari to show you what exactly what i mean oh no now for an example of promotion you know when you're scrolling through a website and you just do this then you can either go too fast or too slow or it goes fast and just stops automatically just like that and it, it's just hard to use it's frustrating but with the iphone 13 you say goodbye to that because let me show you an example just type in calculation and then you just enter anything it, it does exactly what you wanted to do when you wanted to do it and it is just awesome it it feels awesome now that you enter you can enter any app you scroll really fast you scroll really slow it will follow you like this for example it will follow you you can go fast you can go slow you can go medium you can do this but the phone won't glitch out it won't just jam out of nowhere which is what i love about the iphone 13 now the next thing we talk about is what you've all been waiting for, the iPhone 13 Pro Max camera. The iPhone 13 Pro Max has a pretty good camera, as you can see there. Oh, that is nice. Oh my god. Now let's check out like a previous photo. Whew. Yeah. <laughs> you see the photos, you see the photos the iPhone 13 Pro Max can take? Never mind that she is beautiful, man. Just look at the background. Look at the detail. And that's not the only pictures that I have. Just check out this. Come back, come back. Come check out the details in these photos. It is just incredible. See the photos that this thing can take? You see them? It, it's awesome. So you see, you see this picture right here? Never mind that it is. Never mind that she is beautiful. Check out the detail. Check out the contrast. Check out, like, the tone. iPhone 13. Pro Max pictures are just insane, and you don't, I don't even know how to explain it, I can't comprehend it, but it is amazing, and that's not all this camera can do, now come back, come back, let me show you something so as you guys know, iPhone is basically the king of portrait mode, it basically came up with it, and with portrait, there's a whole lot of stuff you can do, you can see options, you got the natural light, you got the panel, you got the natural light, it gives you studio light, right there you see it made me prettier, <laughs> it got the contract light, the high key, whatever this is, if you're shooting a horror movie or something, but this thing is really fun to play with, and you can end up taking some pretty impressive pictures, it also has the video mode and the cinematic mode, and if you need me to explain what cinematic is, a cinematic mode is basically a video where it, it just helps you like in a movie form. It blows out everything around you and focuses on you. And when you give your focus to another object, it will automatically put its focus on that object. Which by my what I think that is pretty cool. Now another thing I love about this camera is even though it is at the iPhone 13, it is at the iPhone 12 Pro Max, this camera is smarter. This camera is very smart, and there's a lot of things that it can do that the 12 can't do. Like one of the one of my favorites, the the macro lens. For some reason, iPhones usually don't have that. Apple refused to give them the macro lens, which I think is stupid. But on the iPhone 13 Pro Max, we need to worry about that because it does have the macro lens. And if you're an aesthetic person like me, you can take some pretty cool pictures of this thing, and it can go really close and show you a lot of detail. And I love that. And check out the night pictures. This camera can take some incredible pictures at night. It has a night lens. That's why I see this phone is incredibly smart. Check out this picture I took at night. That is incredible. It has it can take some pretty good pictures. It got some different modes. You can choose between different variety of pictures. It is just incredible. It has one of the best cameras in the world. Okay, so that's basically what the phone has and what the phone can do. And here is what is in the box. So basically, like iPhone Monate, Marao, iPhone get scam. All that comes in the box is the phone and the charger. You get nothing else. This is a thingy that lets you access the SIM card jack thingy. But all that comes here is the cable. And the adapter, nah, that ain't free, dog. You gotta buy it yourself. 
and it has this little thingy with the flyers and stuff we got some uh, manual we got the iphone sticker you normally see this on the, those texts or the kasi taxi drive or cars or ubers or whatever but yeah it comes with that i don't really know where you're supposed to stick that maybe on your couch or something but that's basically all that it comes with you, you have to buy the adapter well, when we got it, we also got it with the adapter. This is what the adapter looks like. You have to buy a special type of adapter. It doesn't just work with anything. But this is not free. This can range up to 300, 400 for the first one. But yeah, you can't just get that for free. But that's basically what it comes with in the box. Okay, so that was the unboxing and review of the iPhone 13. This video, by the way, was not taken by the iPhone 13. But stay tuned, like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos that will be taken by this thing. And I'm sure we're going to have some pretty cool videos. Oh, yeah. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos where I'm going to be showing you tips and tricks for the iPhone 13 Pro Max and the first things to do when you get your iPhone 13 to make it um, the best experience possible. So, yeah. That, I'm Little Man J, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out. And you're looking at me.